Whether you need to know how to ship a dress for a destination wedding or take your wardrobe cross country, we can help. Let's look at your options. Depending on your preferred shipping method and items, you may need a wardrobe box or other sturdy corrugated box, hangers, acid-free paper or muslin cloth, plastic garment bags, packing tape, and packing materials. High value clothing like wedding dresses, tuxedos, and designer accessories need a little extra TLC to stay sharp in transit, but the process is almost the same as shipping casual clothing. Choose a box that's the right size for your items to avoid paying more than necessary. Use the H taping method to seal the bottom of the box, applying tape equally across all the seams and flaps. Fold your items according to their design and smooth out wrinkles as you go. When shipping delicate fabrics or items with embellishments, wrap in acid-free tissue paper or muslin cloth. Place the tissue paper or cloth between every layer of fabric. For extra protection, encase your garment in a plastic bag. If you're shipping multiple items, stack or place them to maximize the space in the box. Pack the box with packing materials to keep your garment from shifting during transit. You may want to use heavy-duty packing materials for delicate items. Place a copy of your shipping label in the box and seal the top. Then, place the label on the outside of the box to increase the chances that it will be shipped in the preferred orientation. If you need to move your whole wardrobe, you can also use a wardrobe box with a hanging rod. It's a quick way to transfer a closet full of both casual and formal attire. You can pick one up at a FedEx office location. Start by assembling the wardrobe box. Seal the bottom of the box. Hang the rod inside the box. Now hang your clothing on the hangers, making sure to button all buttons and zip zippers. For extra protection, wrap delicate items in a plastic bag. Put the bottom of your hanging clothes into the box first, adjust them, then hang the hangers on the rod. Add other items such as hats or purses in the bottom of the box if they'll fit. Avoid packing shoes unless they are individually wrapped to avoid soiling clothes. Place a copy of your shipping label in the box and seal the top. Place the label on the top of the box to increase chances that it will be shipped in the preferred orientation. If shipping a t-shirt or other light clothing, a durable shipping poly bag can be used. We recommend a minimum bag thickness of 3 mil. For heavier items such as jackets, you'll need a thicker bag. Place the clothing into a thin plastic bag to protect from dust or moisture. Insert it into the poly bag with a copy of your shipping label and seal the bag as intended. You can add an extra strip of tape across the seal for added security. Place the label on the top of the bag on its largest face. Now, you know how to ship clothes, so you can dress to impress whatever your destination. For more packaging tips, visit fedex.com packaging.